Where should we go on a sunny day? So I'm going to go to the Marshall Jones Mansion. Then let's take the bus and go. I arrive at Marshall Jones Mansion Museum. The big statue in the middle is Marshall Jones. Then shall we go buy tickets? This is the ticket office. The ticket price varies depending on where you want to enter. I will briefly explain today's video tour. Museum interior and structure, history hidden in the museum, restaurants to enjoy after viewing. Last start! There is a soldier statue in the front of interest. Now let's go inside together. Before I go in, I will simply introduce the inside of the museum. Here is a car that they pick up children. There is an office right next to the car. Inside, we can see people working hard. If you come out, there are various rooms. On the left in the room where they welcome guests, on the right is the room where guests can rest. If you go deep inside, there are two places about this life, first room about this life. Let's go inside. If you go inside, there is a statue merchant down when he was young. The room on the left is from 91 to 1922. On the right is from 1922 to 1933. There is detailed description of his childhood. In the room on the right, there is a story of his marriage. Now this is the second statue in the space about his life. The room on the right is from 1937 to 2001. On the right is from 1934. Left room serves the great exercise of chimpanzees. In the room on the right, there is a story until he ends his life. If you go deep behind the building, there is a house where Marshall Jung actually lived at the time. This building looks the same as before. There is one room on the right and one room on the left. First in the room on the right, there is a room where he had meetings with people. In the left room, there is a bedroom. Where we leave this building, there is a house where his third wife lived. Studying room. If you go back more, there is a big bedroom. There is a small window inside the bedroom. The wife could see her husband's house from the window, so she only looked at her husband's house on the day she wanted to see him. First, I will talk about Merchant John's Museum. In fact, this museum used to be an ordinary house. This house was inhabited by Mer Shedong and his son Zhang Shedong. So, who is Zhang Shedong? I will introduce everything about him. Zhang Shedong is the first son of Zhang Zhuilin who ruled China. In 1922, at the age of 25, he became commander of his father's army. Zhang Zhuilin was sent back to Manchuria. The train is blown by the Japanese army, killing him. And the result, Zhang Zhuilin succeeded his father and became to rule Manchuria. Then in 1931, Japan started to control Manchuria. Zhang Shidan tried to attack Japan right away, however, decided to attack the Communist Party at the instruction of the politician Chiang Kai shek. But Zhang Shidan and Chiang Kai shek had different ideas. In this way, Chiang Kai shek worked hard to subjugate the Communist Party. Zhang Shidan did not like his behavior. As a return, Chiang Kai-shek attacked Chiang Kai-shek. This is an accident. And the protest on the accident, Chiang Kai-shek was arrested and he went to Taiwan. I am done explaining. To put it simply, Now Leslie, We get hungry when we go to museums. There is restaurants a good place to go when we are hungry. 